Hi everyone. I'm having trouble with this computer now. I don't know what is happening. Um, today I got the crash of Snagit twice. Um, this has been happening now oh, far more frequently and uh, yeah I did get the captures because yeah, always have to prove, prove that you're not lying. It's finalizing video. Okay, a two minute video could take forever. And well, if it's longer, it finalizes and finalizes and it just goes on and on and on. And then the program crashes. Uh, yes. I have defragged, I defragged yesterday, I have, I think, what did it say after defragging it, like zero or point zero one fragged, you know, so it should be in good operating order. Um, I clean it regularly, I'm, I have a malware program, so this just, can, it's, yeah, far more frequently. Today, I'm tired. I'm really mm, tired. So, I'm going to read a comment and then I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, I don't I don't get it. This is a computer that I've only been working on for maybe a couple of months. Uh, and it's worse than my old computer that was continually giving me problems until it died. This actually is worse. I can't get an editing program on it. And yeah, the editing... This is an old Windows uh, 7. I tried using the editing program on the computer. It's... I can't... I can't figure it out and getting something to process takes way too long. This happened last night. It's now September 12th. Okay, so I was doing a video and all of a sudden I had very strange problems. Non-stop. And people aren't questioning that, which is pretty frightening. And wow, my... Everything just stopped. Everything just stopped. This is bizarre. I don't know what's happening to my computer. But a lot is happening. So, I apologize for that. I'm not going to. Wow, okay. <laughs> uh... Pages turn on their own. Um, today I was reading an article and the few pages that were open, my computer started dancing in between the pages. Then in this video when I was trying to... Um, the, the, it looked like my capture program stopped, but it didn't because it kept and I recording can't me. The pages. Jesus. This is my life. I'm not kidding. And the capture program is stopping. Everything's stopping. All right. Um, look. Uh, many of us have an awful lot going on in our lives now. So. Yeah. When you are receiving so many comments from people that you don't know, you know, all right, you don't care too much, but I have to tell you, this comment from Cindy Gray, my subscribers, you guys who have been with me forever, <laughs> Do you remember 
all of what I've posted on my two Kafka Winston World channels. Even on this channel, it's really remarkable. Um, I just want to read the comment and then uh, I just don't have the energy anymore so I don't know what is going on uh, people are behaving very bizarrely in real life and in this cyber world this it's uh, <laughs> I want to thank each and every one of you who are supportive. Uh, thank all of you for um, sticking with me. Thank all of you, which unfortunately are a few, who are really looking at yourself, looking at your own truth, trying to manifest actually manifest a better world um, because I guess so many people just don't see the connection between how we operate in our own life and the bigger picture the nightmare that we are living but here I'll read the comment in full they are all in on it together. Now, this was about this video that I posted yesterday. Does does anybody, did anybody think that I was saying that Putin actually said what he said, Western governments are destroying the planet with chemtrails for control and profit? Because if you did, you're mistaken and if I didn't make it clear, then I'm mistaken how many times in eight years have I said Putin is in on it Cindy said a lot when are you going to realize that they are all in on it any of my all-time subscribers remember me saying the world leaders are all in on it that we're watching a staged play between the United States and China the president of China the president of the United States and Putin and it's all a staged play all right Israel and Russia are key players in the New World Order the only country in the world not getting chemtrails is Israel that's not true uh, Saudi Arabia uh, northern Africa and well I think the smaller countries around there are not getting so hit but Israel I've seen it get hit uh, which is okay chemtrails is Israel which is filled with Russians hang on sorry um, filled with Russians and high technology like we aren't okay uh, the Russians are modifying the weather too. Who do you work for now? Like, who did I work for before? So you want to know who I'm working for now? Highly suspect. All right. Are you addressing your comment to me? And yeah, a subscriber wrote, she knows, don't be a dick, okay? Cindy comes back, yes you are acting like Putin is warning America do people listen anymore did I say Putin is warning America was I acting like or sounding like Putin was warning America Wow uh, when in fact Trump is under Putin Russia Israel Rothschild are I love the capital are the big players you never mention Israel behind all this crap going on really so Cindy you were a subscriber of mine Kafka wins tomorrow but I don't watch all of your videos so maybe you didn't see all of my videos 
Uh, you guys that have been with me for a while, do you remember all the videos that I posted on the Israeli government, Rothschild, uh, and the um, communist takeover, communist goals, reading them and showing, yeah, well, these are the 45, I think, 45 communist goals to take over the United States. And, well, most of them, they've been very successful. How many videos did I post on how we have a communist infiltration in every institution and Zionist infiltration in our U.S. government? All right. You never mention Israel behind all this crap going on. Hmm. No. I guess all those 9-11 videos that I posted on the dancing Israelis. How many times have I said, you know, and posting on Israeli false flags? I mean, I've posted on so much, trying very hard to post those videos, you know, connect the dots. Um, you never said a word. Oh, you know that Israel, Russia, Rothschild officially took over America July 1, 2019. You never said a word. I reported on it several times. Cindy, I don't watch a lot of your videos. I don't uh, watch a lot of videos anymore. I mean, I've said so many times, I'm overwhelmed an overload. I can't keep up. Uh, there's so much going on. I don't even know what to post on anymore. Um, and stating very clearly, yeah, my brain is not okay. Confused a lot. I have no clue what I'm doing most of the time concentration shot and just not capable of doing what I used to do. So no, I didn't, I have no clue what you're talking about. I should have just read my responses, sorry. All right, you never said a word. I reported on it several times. It is worldwide subversion of the people of the world. All world leaders are in on it. We can't free our world until people start telling the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Tavistock is a worldwide agenda of mind subversion. How many? I mean, my God, I've posted on so much of what she's saying I didn't post on. Oh, and you should know that. Yeah, I do, because I've posted on it and did research on it, Cindy. Part truth doesn't free mankind. No, well, I've been telling people, go for the full truth, which means look at yourself. Look at what you're doing and how you're behaving and the presumptions that you're making about people and then spitting them out publicly, which influence a whole lot of people. Uh, but here we go. Uh, my subs keep complaining about you and your obvious omissions of truth and Israel, Russia, Rothschild connection. Don't try n or not trying to be mean, Carol. I'm desperately trying to free our world. Oh, okay. No one else is, Cindy. Just you. You're working hard. No one else is. I have been under attack for speaking the truth for a while now. Yeah, just you. I'm not. No one else is. Just you. Partial truth just confuses people, and that isn't helping anyone. Just saying. I... Well, she came back, not to mention that Russia, Israel, China, Rothschild also use weather warp, fair weapons too, uh, including geoengineering, have been for several... Are you kidding me? Um, I think people are really 
getting affected by the frequencies. And if they don't know who they really are, if they've never really done any work on themselves, they can easily transform them into something else. Now, well, I'll go on. By the way, go to the ADL, Aka Israel, where are where are cops, where our cops are trained, including where the backscatters come from, the uh, Shertov group, all the policies that are destroying America are made in Israel, Russia, Rothschild, Soviet subversion. I'll address your comments in a video, too much in them to address in writing, but you have really surprised me. Uh, then she writes to Teresa Elliott, who said she knows, um, then she should speak the whole truth. Partial truth only creates confusion. Exactly what the New World Order wants. I guess it has to be spoken in every video. The whole truth. Wow, man. I already post really long videos. That's going to be really long. So I wrote, I guess you don't remember all my videos on Kafka Winston World exposing the Israeli government and military, our law enforcement trained by Israeli soldiers. Why our local police now act like we are Palestinians? Or my numerous videos on the communist takeover of the U.S. Or my saying countless times, all world leaders are working to reshape the world for the new world order. Or my videos on the Rothschilds and the Rockefellers, and I forgot to write Tavistock, but my videos on psychopolitics. Yes, uh, the Russians teaching American students who then would infiltrate our university and college colleges on that subversion that Cindy claims I don't speak about. And how our universities and every institution has been infiltrated by communists, or my videos on the Zionist infiltration of our government, or my videos on the ADL, and their list of trigger hate words. Uh, you could not be more off base with what you have written here. You have been a subscriber of mine for a long time, and I've been a longtime subscriber of yours. You are not the only one working hard, Cindy, I have stated in my, in many videos that I am barely hanging on now and I am incapable of posting what I used to, researching what I used to. I stated in videos, I am confused a lot, don't know what I'm doing most of the time, concentration near gone, and that I am overwhelmed, can't keep up, and have no idea what to post on because so much is happening, what you categorize as obvious omissions. You thinking I know about July 2019 Rothschild official takeover when I did not know and have no clue what you were talking about? But go for it, Cindy. Manufacture presumptions about me and make false statements about me. You think if people don't post what you think they should post and clearly they need to post it all the time lest they miss the countless videos already posted of the information that you claim I don't post, then you're a shill. You're a suspect. Who are you working for now? I could care less what your subscribers say about me. I have no idea why it suddenly turned red. Well, it did. I was writing the comment and suddenly I had a red colored font. Never happened to me before, but it did. But it, pay, but it posted as black. So, I know this community is filled with non-thinking imbeciles who believe their belief is truth, and if you don't go along with them, they start gossiping about you on other channels calling you a shill. I didn't think you were one of them. So, um... It's truly unbelievable. You know, I get comments from people who have serious medical issues, who are struggling just to make ends meet, who are struggling 
to feed their kids who are struggling just to function on a basic level. Subscribers who have killed themselves, subscribers who have lost their homes, subscribers who have been destroyed by this new world order. I have subscribers who have been financially destroyed. I have subscribers who have emailed me and I can't believe what people are going through. And so many are going down now. This war is very real. And then you have to deal with this. So many are alone. And I, I, boy, I sympathize, I identify with how many of you have no one. And you have no one to talk to. So many have been disowned by family, laughed at, ridiculed, called names. And the only place that you can find the like-minded is here. And then you come across this bullshit, this immature, warped thinking crap. Well, I'd say trust has been pretty much destroyed and we're on our way to thorough destruction. So I'm censoring comments now when I've said, please leave evidence when you're calling people shills or trashing them. Otherwise, I will delete them. I've lost patience. I'm censoring. How dare I? How dare I? The uh, Cindy subscribers who are complaining it's the all Jews crowd. All Jews. It's all Jews. Well, it's not all Jews. And if anybody thinks that I'm ever going to say it's all Jews, you're dead wrong. I will never. That is such low thinking that it's really scary to see how many quote-unquote truthers don't know how to think. Zionist? Fine. Jesuits? Fine. You want to just, oh, it's all of them, the whole group. And I have got a lot of subscribers who have unsubbed and still all pissed off at me because I won't submit to your low level thinking. I'm tired. I'm really tired. I've had way too much going on just this past week here in good old, this good old apartment complex, listening to everybody lie, the drama, the crap, the immature people who have never gotten out of junior high school. And I see so much of it right here. The good thing is, I don't really care what you think of me anymore. Now, one of the reasons why I've been hanging on to life is because of what my family did with their lies. The malignant narcissist. And I so wanted to get my truth, you know, out there, good and bad. I just, I, there's no way. When you're saturated with liars, when you're saturated around people who don't know how to think, when you're saturated with people who will not do the work on themselves so that they gain the awareness of how they think and how they behave in the world and get the connection between this nightmare that we're living and individuals who are behaving in really 
shitty ways, they'll continue to go on personally attacking people with their presumptions, destroying more and more of this community where, I, look, frankly, I'd love to say it's a joke, but I'm not talking about everyone. There are people who are solid and they're putting out good energy. I will say it's only a few. So call me names, attack me, do whatever the hell you want, tell people that I'm not doing what I'm what I've actually been doing. Go ahead. But you know, you trying to save the world, I'm not here to save the world. I'm simply just trying to put out information that's important and but you know since actually since Harvey something happened and I've not been able to get myself back so I'm going to be talking about it uh, talking about my experience with subscribers talking about what it's like to be homeless talking about what it's like to have had and then get so destroyed that you can't get back. You can't get back your life. You can't. I think a lot of people really do believe that everybody has the same experience. That's but been my experience. You know, in talking to, you know, some subscribers and and then meeting them and, oh, whoa, man, they lied. Great. So, the lying is chronic with a whole lot of people and the lying is causing so much damage. This whole comment here is an abject lie. Thank you, Cindy. You know, uh, I know that you saw videos of mine on Kafka Winston World. Did you see them all? No. You're making a presumption because you posted something on this uh, official takeover of America. Official or not, it doesn't matter. The, the takeover has been ongoing. Um, but no, I didn't know anything about that. Are you thinking I'm watching all of your videos? Um, Many of us who have been around for a while, I would say most people are watching very few videos now. But I literally, my limitations have gotten so bad that I just don't have it in me. So you want to make all the presumptions you want. You're not about saving this world. You're about further destroying it. We needed something here. We needed the support. We needed a, a foundation of trust. And it's these kinds of comments that destroy it. 